So I'm currently at Cable Beach in Broome, Australia, filming a sunset with a P900 on a tracking mount with a solar filter. I also have the Mavic Pro fitted with the solar filter and I plan to put that up to 1000 feet. At that altitude, there you can see the image in the app for the drone, we can see the sun clearly through the solar filter. And we're about eight minutes before the sun sets, so I'll put the drone up shortly. There's the sun and once again you can see changing the exposure value changes the size of the sun flare. And that's why we need to use solar filters. You can see through the solar filter we're getting a much more accurate size of the sun. So the sun has just hit the waterline in the P900. You can see that clearly. It is now setting. In the drone we can still see all of the sun. And as you can see the drone is at 1000 feet altitude. Again you can see without the solar filter it's impossible to get a true indication of the size of the sun. But there it is in the P900 with the solar filter. Still fully visible in the drone. still fully visible in the drone. We're just about to lose the sun in the P900. So the sun has now set fully in the P900. We can still see the whole disc with the drone, but it should begin to set itself very shortly. And it's gone completely to the naked eye, but you can still see the sun flare with the unfiltered image.
and now the sun's gone for the drone as well. So you could see it was significantly later in the drone due to that half a degree of horizon drop from 1,000 feet altitude. And here's the drone returning after its flight, descending from a thousand feet.